So the site audit will help you find the SEO issues on your site. So you can identify and fix those. You've got an overview of SEO or SEO health, uh, uncover additional issues that are impacting your site's traffic. Uh, and then we also provide you with some handy tips on how to fix uh, those things. And then you can also check your site speed as well here. So neilpatel.com, just run a quick audit. So here you'll see the on-page SEO score, which is 79, which is really good. Uh, you, the crawl will also show you the pages discovered. Um, in this crawl, Uber Suggest found uh, 8,651 pages and 983 were blocked for a total of 963 for 34 pages discovered. So it'll show you successfully crawled pages, pages that were redirected, pages that where broken links were found, and then pages that may have been blocked. Uh, from being crawled. And then over to the right, you'll see some SEO issues discovered. That'll get you into the specific audit report. Here, we'll break down all of your uh, issues, critical errors, warnings, and recommendations, uh, sort them based on SEO impact uh, and how difficult they are to resolve. And now you might need the help of a developer if you aren't a developer yourself to fix some of these things. Uh, or you can click here and it'll explain to you what a specific issue is and how you can go about fixing it uh, as well, and then click into the details there. Going back in the site audit overview, as you scroll further down, you'll see uh, some site speed analysis broken down between desktop and mobile. So a uh, word of advice, approach your, uh, your um, optimization of your website from a mobile first perspective. Google indexes websites mobile first, and more people surf the web on mobile devices. Uh, and if you are optimized for mobile first, uh, that generally means that your desktop is perf uh, your desktop is performing just as well or even better. So uh, mobile first perspective. 